up? How's it going, guys? Um, my thing is being stupid. Hey, look at my dirty room. I can't friggin' see anything. I mean, it's not dirty. It's just cluttered. I've got a lot of stuff in it. But anyway, I'm here to show you how I do my hair. Now, I washed it last night, so it's a tangled mess because I don't brush it after my showers. <coughs> um, wait, did I wash my hair last night? Either way, got wet, so we're going to get it back flawless, except it's never flawless. So, I just brush, I just brush it. Did I wash my hair last night? I can't remember if I actually did or if I was just like in there because I wanted to rinse off. Alright, so it's not looking too bad, right? And it's like, neither of these look good. So, you know, I decided not that long ago to take some friggin' initiative and actually start doing my hair in the mornings. So, here's that beautiful frizz that I've got going on. Water in a Clorox kitchen bottle. Don't ask. It's where my water comes from. So I just, legit, I shit you not, this is, this is what I do. And I run my hand through it. And then I continue. And then I just kind of scrunch. And then I do the inside. See, that looks, that looks sort of better. Um, how are you guys doing? I, uh, my setup for recording games is down and I don't know when it's gonna be back up but um, that's why I'm gonna be doing videos like this like vlogs and weird shit random isn't even like my channel I wish I had a waterproof phone and I could spray some of this at you and it'd be like a cool effect So, uh, I don't know how many of you have been keeping up with my life on Instagram. So I know there are a lot more people on Instagram following me than there are on the channel following me. Unless you guys aren't subscribed, but then, yeah. So this is what my hair looks like, sort of, after it's dried a bit when I'm after a shower. So, that's what I do first. Then, my mom sells Avon, so I got this from Mark, which is the youth, teen, young adult, girl, whatever. It's called Curl to Curl, Reactivate and Define Mist. So I take this shit, and I spray that shit everywhere. It's freaking annoying having to do this every day, but it keeps me from having to... Um, straighten it or um, put it in a ponytail like I used to. I'm trying to do more with my appearance recently because I used to look like a hobo. I still do most days, but at least if I actually do my hair and stuff, you know, Appearance is everything in the job I'm going into, so. Yeah, I don't know if I even told you guys. I'm in EMT school. I'm almost done, and it's hard. <laughs> it's, it's hard, but I love it. Um, then I take this. It's a 10 Miracle, oh shit, Miracle Leave-In product. I used to use the light, but I realized that unless I put it on, like, immediately after my showers, it didn't do anything for me, so I got this kind, and I just... You know, I do the same thing. I just, you know, and I feel like some beauty people are going to come in and be like, you're not supposed to mix products or things like that. But I have noticed that this helps me achieve that level of 
beachy wave natural curl that I'm looking for. Sometimes I only use one. Depends on how wet I get my hair first. So that's that. So then I move it back and let it dry under my fan. And then I do my makeup, which I will do in front of you because I have nothing better to do. And I mean, I don't have any content for my video. Sorry, that's all messy and stuff. Oh, my shirt is so wet. Ooh, it's grossing me out. It's all damp. I gotta get a, a wipe to wipe my hands off. I missed you guys so much while I've been gone. Like, I tried. I've been trying to keep up with you guys on social media and stuff, but it's so hard because I'm so busy. Like... Obviously, I could do stuff throughout the day because my classes are at night, but it's not that simple. Like, really, though, it's really not that simple. So we're going to use this palette here, I guess, because it's what I've got that I've been... Because I've been, like, super into using actual colors, you know? Before, I just did, like, shitty smoky eyes. And now I've been like delving, diving, whatever you want to say, whatever you think is correct, uh, into using like real colors, like real, like bright colors and things like that. So I think it's pretty cool. Today, this is the Jessie's Girl makeup collection. I don't know which palette this is, but it's a colorful palette and I gave one to someone else because I had two. I wish I hadn't given them to that person, but, so, yeah. First thing I do is I wipe my makeup brush off because I always forget to do that. I really need to wash them. But, alas, we will do purple today because yesterday I did pink. So we are going to start with this lilac -y color right here. And we are going to put that on the inner corners of my eye and I am not close enough so I'm gonna have to use this as my reference which means it's gonna look really shitty in retrospect but yeah so I've been like more into doing my makeup recently just because I mean like my job is about appearances and um, I feel like if I look better, people will trust me more, and that's a good. So now we're going to use this little bit of a darker purple. I want to use this mauve kind. Well, which one is lighter? I can't... Alright, let's go back this way because you can see. Can't decide if this one's lighter than that. Yeah, I think that one is. So we're going to use this grape looking color. And we're going to put that on the inside all the way to the outer corner. So, yeah. This is going to look so bad. And then I'm going to pull out one of my better palettes um, to do the very outside corner because, you know, I actually have one. Oh, I put it away. I was going to say, I actually have like a specific purple palette. All right now, we're going to take this darkest one that I was debating between and do very outer corner. Just kind of, you know, blend it in there because it's kind of pinkish. So that'll give it a, a warmer tone. All right, let me just... Is it even, even enough? Alright, that's that palette. Now, is there a purple in this? No, there's not. Is there a purple in this? Yes, but it's not the purple I want. So I guess we're gonna have to go with the super crazy, amazing palette that I have. If I can get to it, Jesus Christ. Alright, Naked Heat. That's what I'm talking about. There's this color called Ashes that I particularly enjoy. 
And we're just gonna take a little bit of that, put it on the very outer corners, and just blend to the gods. Well, to God. I don't believe in multiple gods, but you know. I was trying to be funny, but then I realized my mistake. Let me turn towards the light, because, oh, that looks pretty good. Tooting my own horn here. Um, I don't have a flat brush on this one. So, we're going to go and freaking, I don't know, what am I even trying to say right now? That doesn't even belong here. Why is it here? I just re I just moved my room around and I took some like some furniture out of it, so I'm like forever looking for stuff. Even though I did it like just last night, but you know. That's just how it goes, man. So now that my eyes are done for now, we're going to move on to highlighter. So that's really like the only other thing I use besides like lip sense, which I can't put on right now because you know that's something I should do later. And I just woke up, so I haven't brushed my teeth yet. People are gonna be like, gross. Like, dude, I've been busy. Not everyone has friggin' seven hours to get ready in the morning, but I'll go do that after this and then. So this is the Ofra Ofra highlighter in Rodeo Drive, and I love it. This is like my favorite thing ever. I'm using this brush. I love it so much. I didn't realize how much I loved highlighter until it's probably not going to be even. I didn't realize how much I loved highlighter until... I like really started wearing it and I'm like, oh my god, I feel like a princess. <sighs> I need a, I need a moment to observe, oh my, wow, I love it, I don't know, I'm a highlighter junkie now. And now we are going to take this highlighter pen by Thrive Cosmetics. And put it on my inner corner. And then rub it, blend it out. And I just realized last night, because I was looking through my boxes, because this came in a boxy charm. There was like an instruction thing for this. I'm like, why do you need an instruction for a pen? It's a sharpener. I'm like, that's pretty sick. I'm easily amused. Okay, so then there's that. And I haven't been able to find my freaking eyebrow stuff for a million years. So I don't know where that is. But we can continue to the rest of my eye routine, which is... Eyeliner, which I'm probably gonna screw up just because I'm doing it in front of a camera But I use all kinds of different pens. I only use liquid pens. I don't know why it's the easiest way for me to get a cat eye So precise liquid eyeliner pen Avon super extend in black Because you know how else would I do a classic cat eye? It's probably gonna look terrible. Don't judge me. I'm gonna we're gonna here let's let's do this real quick we're just gonna do this so you can watch me look ridiculous but we're gonna okay now we're gonna try to do is it the same good enough See, it's it's like it's not it's not the same and it never is. I mean actually it usually is, but when I really want it to be the same, it's not. So I just I do the wing for some people do the like actually line their eyes for I'm hearing noises. I swear there's like a ghost in my room. Hello. Please don't kill me. 
Please don't possess me. I'm in the middle of something. My life is fanning out in front of me and I cannot die right now. I'm too busy for that. Too busy to die. And then I just continue the line. I'm jumping back and forth. So, I'm thinking about buying The Evil Within, like the game, to play. And I think that would be cool. Does that look so awful? I don't think it looks that bad. Yeah. Then, every day, I decide whether I want to kill my eyes with metal and this tiny bit of really hard silicone or if I want to chance it and try to get an even curl with this one. So we're going to chance it today. Anyway, with this, I think it's Sally Hansen. Yeah, it's a Sally Hansen cover or curler. Okay, so I gotta get close for this one. Cause it's a tedious task, don't you know? See, and I was looking back at my pictures not that long ago, like just random pictures in my gallery. And my eyelashes used to be so poppin'. Like, what happened? What happened in my life? Like, why did everything start deteriorating? Like, this was only like two or three years ago, back when I had my other channel. Oh my god, my dog just scared the shit out of me. What the? Jade, you're adorable. I love you so much. I really do. Yes. Would you like to be on camera too? Hey. This is Jade. I don't know if I've ever shown her before. And now Tootsie Roll's getting jealous. I love Jade. So. Boy. And this is my boy. This is Tootsie Roll. Say hi. I love him. Look at how cute he is. My boy. Okay. Now that my eyelashes are sort of curled, I can put these where they belong. And I was blessed by my aunt. And she bought me the Tarte, Tartist Mascara Lash Paint, is what they call it. And it's amazing. It's my favorite mascara, I swear. I love it so much. So, I'm just gonna, just gonna put that on real quick. Sometimes I like to layer mascaras. But when I do that, I have to do them all while it's still wet. Instead of like over each other, if you know what I mean. You know what I mean? Why am I asking you? I'm expecting a response, but I just realized that you can't respond to me yet. I've got to wait a while until I upload this and then look at the comments. And I need to... Hold on. Let me do this so you don't have to see my ugly self in the in the whole body all right now we are going to separate these eyelashes that are clumped together with a thumbtack because I'm one of those people that looks sort of better now I carefully, and I mean carefully, curl my lashes again. I don't put as much pressure as I did before to avoid cutting my lashes off. And that still looks like trash. All right, let's try this again. Oh, 
Oy. It's like ever since I started using fake eyelashes, because I used them for like probably a month straight. Like I got a big pack of them and then I like stopped using them because the glue whenever I'd put my eyeliner, like I'd put my eyeliner and then the glue and then I could never get my eyeliner off. Like it'd take a million years. But ever since then, my lashes have been like curling weird or they'd be like in a weird position, if you know what I mean. Like they don't fan out. They all like stay weird. Like I don't know how to explain it. But since I'm feeling cool, I'm going to use another mascara. I'm just going to pick one random. This winged out super extend mascara by Avon in blackest black because that's how it goes in Avon. I'm just gonna do a little bit over it on both sides. Oh, that helps. And yeah! Yeah, that's a lot better. Probably looks terrible to you guys because like look at that. I don't understand. Like what? how do I change that? Probably gonna have to use some like serum or something. But that is my look for the day. I've got to pick which lip scents I want to use because I have like a million. It's never enough. Just letting you know, don't ever buy lip scents. I love it. I want to advertise for it, but no. Don't ever get it because then you'll get addicted and then it'll suck because you have to buy every new one that comes out and all the ones you don't have and you like all these different colors. And you're like, oh, well, I don't have enough pinks. Let's get another pink. Or I want another purple. Let's get another purple. Or I want another brown. It, ugh, it just goes like that. So I think today we will continue the purple and go with purple rain. It's upside down. Purple rain. Um, I'll put that on later. But yeah, I hope you guys are having a beautiful day. And I will talk to you soon. Glitterly out.